Okay, and then we have next task is this timing chain cover removal and there are now some things what we have to take before of that away. First one is this sprocket, this drive belt sprocket in here. There are two 12 millimeter bolts and then in this down area there is this oil sump and there are two bolts in this down area. What we have to find there's really two bolts in here. But when we open then this all poles in that area, in this side area, we can take that away. But I start this my job in this part. This is like drive belts support feel. And I need for that job 12 millimeter socket. And I firstly open this upper pole. A note. There is that side of bolt and then similar in here down area and now this support feel opens and this purpose and there is by the way central bolt also that we can replace this feel also. Okay cool. And after that I start to open these bolts in this side area and let's go to look at where I start. I start in this up area and there are really two 12 millimeter bolts in here. First one, now it's open and second. And the, look, they are longer. They belongs in this top area and then when we go in down here is also 12 millimeters and this is free also and then in this area there is second and all of these are same size and then in here we have fifth and let's look all of these are same size, excellent. Then we go in here a little bit down, in here, and here is also 12 millimeter bigger bolt. And let's look at it is also same size, good. Then we go in that area, there is also 12 millimeter in here, good. And then, when we check, is there any another 12? No. Then there is 10 millimeters left. Okay, and then I have 10 millimeter socket. And now when we go through that area, first bolt is in that side, in here, the small one. And there is length. It is that size. It is important to check that what is the size. And then there is this, this tensioner cover, and there are small bolts, look, thin, three small, let's look in here, and there is interesting steel cover, now, now I kept this in this area, then we can go in down, and we check that there is second bolt in this, this uh, near of this water pump area in here and there is a little bit longer bolt and then we look in this side in here there is 10 millimeter and sides is same type little bit longer and then this bolt in here and maybe similar yes they are same sides and then we go in more down in here we have then in this area this next bolt 
and sides is same sides and then next one is here okay and there there is this is different bolt look this is now special bolt in here and let's look close okay and here is really adjusting bolt Honda's engineering special it is larger larger and this bolt really goes in here this side area it is like side marker remember that and this is good to mark that we remember that it is unique and then when we look in this area in here okay let's look in here is there similar in that down area look there are like side bolts in this area and this is really unique two unique bolt and then this one is normal yes this is normal okay normal and now we can see the difference in here okay and now i believe that that this side is okay but in then this down area in here there are two bolts what we open next okay and now when we look in this oil filter and then in that down area there is two 10 millimeter bolts what we can open and they are a little bit longer look they are now lo longer they are longer bolt they belongs in here and this is also longer okay and now we can see that these are really longer like five centimeter bolts longer bolts in this down area excellent okay and now cylinder uh, sorry this timing chain cover opening now when we have take all of these bolts away then we need big flathead screwdriver and we install that in this dance and we carefully we start to paint this in this way firstly in here now we can see that it moves there is nice dent what we can use in that way and now we can see that it really moves nicely it's like starting point then we go in a little bit in down area and there is next pot what we a little bit move in that way and if we notice any any difficulties do not break too much because there can be some bolt what is still in position but we go in down area more deeper and all of there are small dents that using those those dents i can now manage manage to open this cover so much excellent okay and now this cover really moves and i can use both sides carefully and now this cover opens very nicely now we can see that it is really it is really free and i can carefully move this part in in away and we can look this another direction that we can see that what it looks like there is this there is oil pump in that area and this is timing chain uh, sorry timing chain timing chain tensioner cover and there is crankshaft this oil gasket if you have any leaks in there and then this part is plastic cover what takes contact in this central this camshaft Note.